And with this being Memorial Day weekend, how can we not be inspired by military figures and military quotes? And so the one that comes to my mind today is from Mr. Colin Powell. And um, General Colin Powell, uh, not to slight him in the least, of course. And that is, there are no secrets to success. I agree, 100%. Hey everybody, I'm Adam and this is your Daily Dose of Today for May 25th. Quick announcement, Tuesday, when everybody's back from the holiday, I plan on sharing my four magic words. I call them magic because it just, these four magic words for me can turn around almost every situation that I'm in and open the doors for me to make progress or get past an impasse. So I'm gonna share those on Tuesday, be sure to stay tuned. Uh, come back. I just want to wait till everybody's back from the grind. We're coming into the holiday weekend, celebrating Memorial Day, which is reserved for those who never got to take off the uniform, died in uniform, uh, in the battlefield defending our freedoms. And so, if you are a family member of one of these survive or one of these um, fallen heroes, thank you so much. Thank you for your for your sacrifice. Uh, thank you for enduring your suffering and pain that we can have our freedoms and con condolences for your loss and your, your loved one is a hero and holds a special place in my heart. And with this being Memorial Day weekend, how can we not be inspired by military figures and military quotes? And so the one that comes to my mind today is from Mr. Colin Powell. And... Um, General Colin Powell, uh, not to slight him in the least, of course. And that is, there are no secrets to success. I agree, 100%. I hope everything here in the Daily Dose of today has not been earth-shattering secret. It's not. And when I think about the things, I, what I try and do is I just try and get you to there's a bunch of distraction out there and I just trying to pull away the distraction pull away the noise to point out some of the most obvious things that's what reframing is all about your situation isn't so bad if you peel back and look at it you're actually in a pretty good spot you're just allowing emotion or other things to get in your way but I, I truly hope that with that I have had an impact and I know I have for some of you, you've shared it, but I hope in the impact that I've had has been more along the lines of, wow, that's so obvious. I'd never thought of it that way, but that's so obvious. You're right. And because that's all I want. That's what I want for you. Honestly, if, if somebody tells you something, you're like, oh my gosh, that's amazing. That's, a, that's like, I can't believe like nobody ever thought of this before. They're pro it's probably a gimmick. I mean, we've been on this earth, depending on how you look at it, for millennia. Plus, we've got recorded history, certainly, of millennia, of successful people. There's no secrets. If you're going to do it honestly, it comes through hard work, perseverance, so on. Some people, again, it depends on how you define success. I think the only way you can be successful is to come by it honestly. I don't view people who were born with silver spoons in their mouths, have millions of dollars, and make millions of more dollars as successful. I'm not saying they're not successful, but I don't look at them as, as someone to emulate. That's not real life. That's a 1% of life. If you're born with mass amounts of resources, you should do well. If you don't, you're a complete screw up. That's just how it is. Like that's expected. Because one thing I tell you is certainly that I have learned from coming from nothing to the modicum of success I have today. And I don't live in a mansion, you know. I don't have millions of dollars, but I'm successful. The one thing I've learned is the more successful you become, the easier it is to try and get to that next level of success. Because you're building on your own success of knowledge and patterns and, uh, and lessons learned. And you've learned how to come up through that. So my chance of being successful next, in the next venture is uh, even better. Why? Not because I have some magic insight, because I have experience, I have confidence, 
I have determination on my side. I've done it over and over and over again. It's like going from little league to minor league to major league. It's not they just magically got better when they got into the major leagues and now they can hit balls. Consistently got better over time and progressed on. So anyway, I agree 100% with that smart man, Mr. General Colin Powell. There are no secrets to success. Uh, hard work, perseverance, determination, um, and just grinding, believing in yourself, believing in others. Those aren't secrets. It's just called being a decent human being and putting in the work. You can do it. Think about it this weekend. No secrets are being hidden from you. It's all within your grasp, what you've been taught. This has been your Daily Dose of Today. Thank you.